Welcome back to my channel. Today I will be sharing my latest purchase from St. Laurent. I am very excited to share this with you guys and to open this up. So if you saw my most recent unboxing, I recently purchased the St. Laurent Rive Gauche Tote and so I was looking for a clutch or a pouch to keep inside. I was initially looking at the matching pouch. However, when I was looking at different pouches and clutches that were available from St. Laurent, I saw this item and I thought it was perfect because it was only a little bit more and it would um, be more versatile. So I'm going to open this up and so I can share this with y'all. So I purchased the St. Laurent monogram clutch in the quilted grain emboss leather. It is absolutely beautiful guys so you have gold hardware that grain texture and chevron pattern and then it is a clutch so you have a detachable wristlet with a d-ring inside you have the brand name and one long pocket over here and then that is the only compartment that is in here so there's no card slots like the wallet on a chain and i'm very excited about this purchase because you can turn this into a crossbody as well so you can use it as a clutch or a crossbody and i'm going to show you all how to do that in this video as well as what fits inside so i did order this from the nordstrom website and it came in the saint laurent box and it has a dust bag So I've just been binge watching different YouTube videos on how to turn this into a clutch. So I have a chain from Amazon. For the first way, I am going to hook the two ends together and then I'm actually going to hook in the end into one of the hooks again so that way it's a shorter chain and this is how I plan to keep it on my um, stand and if you have a petite arm or a longer chain you could do this to make more of a shoulder bag as opposed to like a long crossbody but you have that option and then all you have to do is just tuck it inside of here and then you're good to go and then you can remove the wristlet if you don't want it on here. I'm primarily gonna use it as a crossbody. So I'm going to take the two ends and start fresh. And so with the same method, I'm just going to clip these two ends back together again. However, this time, I'm just gonna put them inside again and tuck them in. And then I have a long crossbody. And so that is one way that you can turn this into a crossbody. If you want it to be more secure, just in case when you open it and you're afraid that it's gonna fall out, hook it onto the D ring and just hook one. I personally am going to do option number three. So again, starting fresh with the chain, I'm gonna hook one end into the D-ring. I'm gonna keep the wristlet on the, the D-ring as well. And then I'm gonna take the other end and I'm going to clip it onto the wristlet portion. And then I'm gonna keep this across and close it. And then it looks even on both sides with the clasps showing and it protects the leather or at least I feel like it'll protect the leather as opposed to having the you know hard chain on here you have that like leather against leather so it's less likely to damage the interior and then you also still have the option to use the wristlet if you want to remove the chain um, it's an easy fix so 
or if your chain breaks because it's from Amazon so you never know you have that option as well so I think this this is how I'm going to use it whenever I use it as a crossbody this is gonna be my new um, one of my main new going out bags and so I think it's a really nice conversion from a clutch to a crossbody um, but yeah those are just a few ways that you can do that As for what fits, I'm grabbing a few items out of my bag. So I have my Chanel card holder. I have my phone. I'm grabbing my cosmetic pouch. And then I'm grabbing my car keys. And so personally, I don't like to carry a lot of stuff with me, especially if I'm going like out to dinner or if I'm going to an event or, um, you know, any reason why I would use this clutch. It really just needs to hold the essentials, with, which would be money, phone, and keys. If my fiance goes with, I don't even take my keys a lot of times. So, um, and generally he goes with, so I don't have to drive. Um, but I am still gonna show y'all what the key pouch looks like in here. Um, but ultimately, the two items that I need when I go out are my wallet, as well as my phone. So I'm gonna put the card holder in here. And then my card holder is the double compartment card holder. So it is a little bit thicker. Um, so also keep that in mind and I know it's a lot of black on the interior so it might be hard to see um, but I have that tucked in kind of on the cor in the corner and then here is my phone this is the 13 Pro whatever the newest is ever since I quit AT&T I lost count of whatever phone I'm on I just now I get the newest one each year um, so I have this upright and you can see that the camera is kind of sticking out um, but ultimately, if my fiance is going with and I'm going out, that's all I would carry. I wouldn't bring anything else. And so um, it obviously closes perfectly, and that's with the phone upright. I could still keep other things in here, like a compact mirror. Let me show y'all, just in case y'all are in the same boat. Um, I generally don't carry this stuff with me, but I know other people do. So I'm going to grab um, a purse spray. This is the Coco Mademoiselle lip balm and a compact mirror this is the um double mirror from chanel and throw those in here with my phone honestly most of the time i don't even need my phone in here but it is a nice advantage that because i just keep it out but it is like a nice advantage if i could keep it in here if i want to put it away at some point but normally I just keep it like upside down on the table um, but I put in the mirror, the lip balm, and now the purse spray. And let's see if that fits. Nope, that's not gonna fit. Um, I think I just made it too thick. So let's see if I remove the phone. If I put in the purse spray, the lip balm, and the compact mirror. Yeah, so just, it'd be too thick because of the foam, but it fits in perfectly and there's still room to put other essentials. Let me grab my key pouch. Um, so this key holder is the six ring key holder from um, Louis Vuitton. And I normally have my key fob out of my key holder, but here it is kind of out, kind of on top of the purse spray and the lip balm. The compact mirror is behind the key pouch. And let's see how this closes. Oh, yep, yeah, so that does close. Um, it is a little bulky, like it does look like it has a little bit of a hunchback, but I don't think it's too bad, to be completely honest. Like, if I wanted to carry this stuff in here, I, I probably wouldn't, just because I know it's not going to pop open with the amount of force with all the items in here. Um, but you can fit all of that. Um, but ultimately, if I'm going out, this is what it'll look like more than likely. I'll have my keys in here as well as the card holder. And then I can carry my phone, but I just want to tuck it into this back pocket to see how it looks. I kind of want to put the key fob up top just to see. Oh, yeah, so that works. So I can actually carry everything that I need in here. And so... I definitely think I wouldn't add anything else because I think it's just at a good enough point to where I won't worry about it popping open because there's so much stuff in here. Um, like I feel like that won't happen, but it does hold everything that I personally like to bring. Again, you can 
pop out your key if you want. Actually, let me tuck this in and see how it works too, because I know that's how you're supposed to use it and that's how most people use it, so that way y'all can see. So um, I have my big bulky key in here and then, yeah, it still works perfectly. So if you have a bulky key, hold. If you have a bulky key holder and a bulky card holder, they both fit perfectly in here. Um, yeah, that's a little bit of different items. Oh, and they fit with the phone. Um, but yeah, that's just a few items that fit in here. I feel like those are like the big items that are like concerning. Um, that's what I was curious about. Um, but yeah, that is everything that fits in here as well as how to convert it into a bag. Um, I'm very excited to use this and I will definitely give y'all updates. I'm not going to purchase an organizer for it just because there isn't that much space, but I also feel like you don't need it. Like I mentioned, I'm only going to carry a few items in here and so I don't need an organizer for those few items. Yeah, other than that, that is the St. Laurent monogram clutch. If y'all have any questions, please feel free to let me know and thank you guys so much for watching.